Topping your Texas political roundup, state lawmakers returned to Austin to examine two controversial issues that have made national headlines. A couple dozen officials returned to the Capitol to hold hearings. The first examined the abortion procedures of Planned Parenthood and how it handles fetal tissue donations. Texas Attorney General Ken Paxton testified that a video obtained by his office as part of an investigation into Planned Parenthood is consistent with other undercover videos released by an anti-abortion group. What happened to Sandra Bland? The House Committee on County Affairs convened Thursday in hopes of shedding light on the 28-year-old woman's arrest and death in the Waller County Jail this month. The committee heard testimony on trooper arrest procedures and state jail standards. According to the State Jail Commission, Waller County officials failed to complete a two-part mental health screening process as required by law. I think that, that training is the biggest part of this. Uh, that training, whether it's sensitivity training or understanding how to treat someone uh, that is in a stop, uh, that is a big part of this. And we have to sensitize people to where we are in America right now and that people expect solutions, not demagoguery. And Rick Perry struck a populist tone during a speech in New York as he discussed the need to change the rules for Wall Street. The former Texas governor said he was the best positioned candidate to institute needed economic reforms, and he said he would not bail out a single bank on Wall Street. I'm Alana Rocha for the latest 2016 happenings, a look at Texas's trade relations with Cuba, post-embargo, and much more. Visit us online at texastribune.org.